Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Gebo the Shaman and this is my channel, Gebo the Shaman. <laughs> uh, today we're talking about uh, Aries in the 6th house and what it means when you have Aries in the 6th house in your chart. So we'll get into that, but before we go into that, I'll talk about... I uh, just want to let you guys know that I have a, a Vedic Astrology sale going on right now for Vedic Astrology readings. At, uh, you can get 30% off when you go to vincent.thunderwizard.com. You can go there and check that out and read all about what I have to offer there. Um, also, I have an uh, energy work course here. Um, it's uh, called the Self Transformation Challenge. It basically is a course where uh, I walk you through like a morning, a midday, and a nighttime practice. And the morning practice is Kundalini Yoga, midday meditation, and then the nighttime practice is the Qigong. And so by doing this every day, you will um, open up open up and awaken your meridians, your energy body, and you'll get to um, experience like a higher level of energy. So it's great for ascension, it's great for spiritual awakening, it's great for um, becoming more aware, more self-aware, and stuff like that. So yeah, um, so if you want to try it out for a month, it's only 45 bucks, and it's available right here, up here. But if you want to, you know, if you really like that course and you want to buy it in full, uh, pay in full, then and you can be able to download it and put it on your device and whatever, you can go here to gebotheshaman.gumroad.com. And yeah, I have my meditations there. I have all kinds of stuff there. So check it out. Also, um, so yeah, uh, we're getting into... Uh, Aries in the sixth house. So before we get into that, I'll take a drink and we can get into that. Okay, so Aries in the sixth house. So what happens when we have Aries in the sixth house in our chart? Well, in order to understand that, we would need to understand what Aries is. So Aries is the sign of the warrior. It's the sign of masculine energy. Uh, it's ruled by Mars. It's um, the sign of action and like taking action and being very action oriented, very uh, driven, like to driven to accomplish things in the world kind of thing. Yeah, so, um, so yeah, that's, that's the sign of Aries. It's, it's very, very energetic. It's very, um, just a very, you know, very like action oriented and, and stuff like that. It's like, it likes sports, it likes, war, going to war, it's a soldier, it's a warrior, it's, um, the sign of, like, yeah, just all kinds of masculine energy, uh, athletics, sports, things like that, so, yeah, um, and then we have, so we have Aries in the sixth house, so, what is the sixth house? Well, the sixth house is traditionally or naturally ruled by, or uh, I should say Virgo is the natural sixth house. Um, and the sixth house has to do with enemies, diseases, sickness, health issues, um, all kinds of things like that. So, I mean, this can be a really double-edged double sword. Uh, yeah, Virgo is a sign that has to do with health, and we have one of the malefics here. We have, well, uh, Aries is, isn't necessarily a, mal a malefic. It's ruled by a malefic, which is Mars. And, um, yeah, so 
So basically you would have to look at where your Mars is placed in order to um, understand what's going on here and look at also where um, Mercury is placed too because or, or yeah so I mean um, yeah so you mainly mainly it would be where where Mars is placed because that'll give you an indication of what's going on here so um, yeah this it can be a, a double-edged sword it can be really it can be beneficial but it can also be pretty damaging I mean uh, it can be so yeah um, just the thing just the thing is with with Aries in the, in the sixth house is um, that this has to do with like enemies diseases health issues all kinds of stuff like that and so with this here it can show that you have like good health or like you know you have a lot of a lot of energy in uh, there's a basically there's a lot of energy in in your house of in the house of health in the house of enemies in the house of diseases and stuff like that so uh that that can be a good thing if you have like jupiter here um jupiter or or the sun even um the sun and jupiter like those are ben beneficial planets to have in the sixth house because they kind of offset the negative stuff that might be caused by mars or or aries um yeah so um so like it it can be really beneficial you might have really great health uh but but you might need to actually you know um fight for your health like um like Ar aries is the the sign that wants to fight so it it's it's basically in the house of health and um enemies and stuff like that so it it wants to fight for your for your health basically and f and against your enemies so this so yeah it could be very powerful but it can also be pretty uh damaging i mean um yeah it's it's just one of those signs where uh it's kind of a give or take it could it could go really well because because you could have you know athletes with this placement you could have you know people who are super health conscious and like super you know um obsessed about their health um things like that passionate about their health uh Aries has to, has a lot to do with ha with passion so so you know um you could be very passionate about your health and about you know taking care of your health and and stuff like that so it can be can be very beneficial but it can also be you know can also cause problems but i mean you would have to look at other things within your chart too to see what's going on in the whole chart and so if you want me to look at your chart, go here to vincent.thunderwizard.com. It's a current it's currently on sale, so go check it out. Alright guys, let me check on the time here. We're good. So um so yeah, just uh you know, before I let you guys go, I'll just promote my stuff again. If you want a Vedic Astrology reading, you should go to vincent.thunderwizard.com. If you want to check out my courses and just just check them out for one month, go here to patreon.com slash shaman. And if you want to buy the courses outright in full, I have programs on there that are just like 20 bucks too. It's really cheap, really affordable. Um, you can check that out here at gebothashaman.gumroad.com. So yeah, also be sure to uh, to subscribe, hit that bell notification, click the bell to the like button, and all that good stuff. So yeah, 
I appreciate you guys doing that, and we will talk to you later. Peace.